guys and welcome to the buy and view this is going to be the press press conference reaction no we've done that the preview for uh Werder Bremen versus Bayern Munich obviously tomorrow uh and um I'm super duper excited for the game again get to watch Bayern play why wouldn't I be um but yeah big up to everybody hopefully guys are all doing well as per usual please do smash the thumbs up comment subscribe all that good stuff socials are obviously above as always and yeah we're, what we're going to be doing uh, on this one obviously is the preview but i want to say straight away thank you to uh, everyone for the constant support uh let me refresh this so i get the correct number 3758 i believe that's what 20 30 subs i'll be gone up which is mad for the channel the, the size of the channel we've got uh and uh the the video that we did um yesterday with the um uh luke the villa fan 2.2k bro that's mad. That is bonkers. So thank you so much for the support. Uh, obviously, that's probably because it's come over from his channel, but whatever. It is what it is. Uh, and without further ado, let's get into this because I am rambling as per usual. Um, so if we go present screen, bonk, bonk, like so, then put this full screen because that's where it should be. Get rid of that. Go down there. So this is how Verda Boyman are doing at the moment. So obviously, Bayern Munich are top at the moment. Uh, we're the only club um to not uh draw or lose uh which is good uh for us we, we've got three wins on that on the dot at the moment uh which is good dortmund have obviously dortmund and leipzig are both one two but they've also drawn one each uh so yeah I, I we just need to stay on the top at the end of the day i think we should be pushing for what did leverkusen get last season 90 points we should be pushing for 90 points again um you know this in itself is it's terrible, um, to be honest with you. So, yeah, we should be pushing for 85-plus points this season. Uh, and hopefully we'll we'll get there, especially with Kane firing all cylinders. But, yeah, that's where Bayern is. Werder Boyman are here, though. Uh, they are eighth. Uh, they've had one win, two um, draws. They're a very good team. And it's also at their place, in their stadium. You know what I mean? Um, so, yeah, they're not going to mess around, put it that way. Um, for them, though, they've only had uh, four goals, four, and three against, which low-scoring games, man. Low-scoring games. Uh, obviously, it's in the uh, Visa Stadium. I believe that's how you say that. Um, and, yeah, I'm, I'm ready ready for this game, most definitely. If we go through their um, games just a minute, though. So, they did get a red card in this game. Um, their captain got red carded. So, for us, obviously, they got the win. Good for them. But he obviously won't be playing against us, which is a good thing because uh, it'll be without their captain. But they did win that game. Uh, they lost here against um, Monster, uh, Monster, sorry, um, in a club friendly. Um, why are they playing a the club friendly in the 5th September? I don't know. Uh, but here's one of the draws that Dortmund got as well as them. So they got a draw with Dortmund. Uh, yes, it was a 10-man team, but, you know, t these two draws, like 2-2 two -two with Augsburg, 0-0 with Dortmund, you know, they beat Mainz. Um, who was the other team that they beat? Uh, oh, no, that was the team, wasn't it? So, yeah, from the three games uh, in, a, in a weird shape here, a 2-2 draw with Augsburg. Um, Dortmund got a 0-0 with them and went down to 10 men. And then they went down to 10 men in their most recent game to Mainz, but still did get the victory. So big up to them, as always. Uh, obviously, we, like I said, are, are top of the table, of course. Um, they go on full match schedule. Um, you know, we beat uh, Hosting Khalil 6-1 here. We beat Freiburg 2-0. Uh, and then we beat Wolfsburg 3-2. Uh, realistically, they should have scored, but whatever. Uh, and then, obviously, the re most recent game in the Champions League, which, you know, is a different competition. Obviously, we won 9-2, uh, which everyone will know. So, yeah, let me know how you're feeling about this game. Big up to everyone as per usual. Uh, I just want to check Twitter one second. Uh, Twitter, X, whatever you want to say. Uh, so out of the game tomorrow for us is just the basic ones of Sancho Bowie, Ibrahimovic, uh, Perez, uh, Stanisic and Ito. Uh, Neuer is not out, which is good. So it doesn't mean he's going to play tomorrow, but he's not out, which is, you know, the the, bet, the better thing to say. Um, with that, though, let's go into this screen here. So we're going to go through uh, the lineup. That's the plan. Um, so yeah, let's just go straight into the lineup. Uh, apologies for the ads. There's not really much I could do. Just keep getting rid of them, but whatever. Uh, so straight away, I think I, I do think Neuer will play. Um, a company made it in here, made it known in his press conference 
uh, which was today that we did uh, earlier, that he doesn't really want to be changing the team too much. He said that there might be rotations, but not too much. So straight away, that's that's generally who I would play. We need Neuer. We can't have sponge hands and goal. We need to keep this momentum going. We're, we're I believe, still top of the Bundesliga. We're still top of the Champions League. We just need to keep this going um, and not mess around, basically. Um, here, now, it's probably going to be Kimmich, but I think we could get maybe, maybe just maybe, hear me out, we could actually get away with putting Lima in here. Um, I don't mind if it's Kimmich. It probably will be Kimmich, but I don't mind if Lima plays there, to be honest. It's going to be uh, Upa and Kim. Uh, I don't see him changing until... Oh, not Kimmich. No, 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 no. Definitely not Kimmich. Um, uh, Kim, and J Kim Min. So we don't click the wrong one again. Uh, I don't see him changing the, this uh, duo until uh, we get Stanisic or Ito back, to be perfectly honest with you. Left back is probably going to be 19, but for his um, his game um, in the Champions League, I would actually play Guerrero because, yes, he was in the midfield. He was over here, but that's not the point. The point is that he had a really good performance, um, so I would play him personally. Uh, they'll be going to the midfield. If he doesn't go with Kimmich in the right back spot, it will probably be Kimmich and Polinia. Um, again, everybody knows my opinion on um, Pavlovic. Uh, he's an amazing, amazing player. But for me, um, you just have to start uh, uh, Polinia. You just do. So, yeah, him and Kimmich will be the pivot, I believe. Uh, and then this is where it gets interesting. So, I I would like Muller to play, but I think he's going to play Jamal here again. I want Jamal on the left. I really, really do. Uh, there's been a lot in the in the media of recent time uh, about um, Matthias Tau, him not getting game time. So I don't know if he will, um, but I have a feeling he'll put Matthias Tau in. Um, he obviously said he was a young player, this, that, blah, blah, blah. But that, that's generally how I see it. I think he will he will go and do that. So, yeah, Matthias Tau in there. If not, though, it probably will be Serge on this side. Uh, and then Olase, um obviously got two goals uh, in in the in the most recent game. Uh, one with his head, the other one was a good goal as well. Uh, and yeah, for, for, to be to be straight up, he has to play. Uh, you know, if he doesn't want to play Tal, call play Nabri this side. Um, but don't be starting Coman or Sane over Olase. Uh, yeah, cool. He's a young player. He's a, he's a young bucky. You know, he's just signed, so he has to play. No, generally he has to play for the quality. Bun all of this other shit that people are talking about. And then obviously the main man, Hurricane, goes up front. So yeah, that would be my lineup. Let me know what you guys think. Again, it is quite full strength. He might drop certain players. Obviously, like I said, Sancho Bowie is out. So that's why I put Conrad Blimer there. But realistically, for stability, I believe that's a word, um, or to be stable at the back, we're probably going to need Kimmich at the back. But hey ho, it is what it is. Let me know what you guys think. I'm going to go with Bayern Munich winning. Um, Hmm. Bayern Munich. I think we will win, but I do think we're going to concede because just because of this um, defense. So I'm going to go with a 4 1 win. Let me know what you guys think. Smash the thumbs up, comment, subscribe, check out the socials. There might be a live show in a little bit. I'm not sure. Um, but until then, Mir Samir, peace out, B1.